Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Uh, today I wanted to cover just a quick part of an ayah in Surah Al Isra, towards the end of Surah Al Isra, uh, that I found to be very beautiful when I first read it, and I wanted to share its beauty with you and kind of go into the ayah and dissect it a bit, inshaAllah. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in the Quran, Ba'da a'udhu billahi min ash-shaytan rajim, Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. And the translation of this is Say, call upon Allah or call upon the most merciful Whoever you call upon, that Allah has the most magnificent name What are the names of Allah? What are Asma al Husna? Allah has many names and they're attributed to Him in the Quran and the Sunnah and the Hadith of the Prophet Muhammad Among them is the name Ar-Rahman, the most merciful This is the one that we use every day in Surah Al-Fatiha Ar-Rahim as well, we use that every day in Surah Al-Fatiha. Now look at other names that Allah has. Allah is saying in this ayah, Rahman. Say, call to Allah or call to Rahman. It doesn't matter who you call to. Allah has so many names. What that means is that Allah is your solution or Allah has the solution to all of your problems. He is Ar-Razzaq. What does Ar-Razzaq mean? He is the one who provides sustenance. You might be going through a tough time with financial matters. Call upon Allah. Allah also says in the Quran, وَإِذَا سَأَلَكَ عِبَادِي عَنِّي فَأَنِّي قَرِيبٌ Which means, if my servant asks about me, then I am near. One of Allah's names is also at tawab What does at tawab mean? It means the forgiving. If you are having issues or if you feel like you've had a past where you've done things that you might not have done or, or you might not have done if you were more responsible or that you should not have done, then ask Allah for His, His forgiveness. And Allah is the most forgiving. Allah is also a sami which means the all-hearing. If we're asking Him to solve any of our problems, He is there, He can hear us. Allah also has the name Al-Basir, the all seen He sees everything that we do, good or bad. I encourage you to go and look at all the names of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and try to find meaning in every single name and try to apply this meaning to how Allah can help you or how you can improve your relationship with Allah, inshaAllah. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.